Hey shop rats, welcome to the Prop Shop, the show that shows off your cool creations. I'm your host Adam Hazing, there's a thunderstorm outside. But the first thing we have up for you today is from Santa, and he's showing you his Halo Reach AR build. So fun board, just for the detail. This worked out perfectly, it's the first time I've, I've tried this. It's worked out quite good. William Jakes here is back with two more amazing videos. The first one is Steampunk Sword Gun. Like ribbons. You can buy packs of brads and gears like these at most hobby stores. I glued this decorative drawer handle into a hole scrambled in the base of the hill. And here's the finished product. And the second is a Star Trek parody. Sir, are we really going to surrender? Never. Not even if I have to sacrifice every red shirt under my command. Are you making a mad machine? Well, guess what? Thomas Clark has a great way to remove material from it to get those holes or those bevels looking nice. Shave down some of this metal. I've got uh, two wood rasps here, believe it or not. Man at Arms Reforged is back with their second video to show off a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle super weapon of destruction. Weird Girls has another great video from you. Zombie is telling you some great foam armor building tips. You just heat gun it right down the center like this. And then you would, when it's still hot on the inside, you would hold it on the outside like this. And just wait until it cools down a little bit. Sometimes you give it a little blow. You don't have to do that. Don't do that. Are you trying to become the king of Middle Earth? Who is it? Well, guess what? Nate Space is showing you a Sauron gauntlet tutorial. You gotta make the one that's the right hand next. And I thought I just made a little turn into a tutorial. Johnson Arms is giving you great tips on how to reuse your cardboard boxes. They expensive. It essentially just reheats up the sticky back part of the sticker, making it really easy to take it off. Mandy on the RPF is showing you her amazing Dragon Ball Z Saiyan armor. Over at Punish Prop, Bill Duran is giving you an incredibly detailed, informative video about his M98 sniper rifle from Mass Effect. Using that bandsaw at a 45 degree angle and using the fence to make sure that they were all nice and uniform cuts. The handle is the only part that's kind of a little organic, so I used a chisel and then a rasp with an air powered rotor bit. Miss Pirate Savvy's back and she's showing you a great way to make clay skulls for your armor pieces. This is craft foam and EVA foam. I'm going to teach you how to make the skulls. And our last little announcement before we leave is that our podcast, The Prop Shop, has almost broke a thousand downloads. So thank you everyone for helping and supporting that. If you haven't already, be sure you check it out on iTunes or Stitcher. Or just kind of watch it on YouTube because we do post it there sometimes, you know. And besides that, thanks for being a subscriber. Be sure to click on clicking. And until next time, we'll see you guys later.